too early to stop, but that would be a really nice campsite. I love the benches. All the rain means the springs are flowing really, really nicely right now. Sounds like, though, things are going to get pretty dry over the next 30, 40 miles. I think there's a 20 mile stretch where there's no reliable water at all. So definitely some planning to take place. So the current situation is rain, it has rained all night, and it's about 45 degrees. The rain is supposed to stop here in just under an hour, I think. So I decided I got a short day today, I'm just going to wait the rain out, trying to keep everything dry because the rain and cold trend is going to continue. So it's very, very important that... Uh, keep my clothes as dry as possible, at least my sleeping clothes, and keep my sleeping bag dry, so we're just kind of hanging out, waiting for the rain to stop. So shout out to uh, Hilltop Packs. I was really worried about my food hanging out in the rain all night, but uh, outside is soaked, but the inside is bone dry. Alright, trying to get packed up and get moving. It's going to be a cold, yucky hike day, I think. Well, supposedly, past this rock pile is supposed to be one of the best views in Pennsylvania. But I am guessing I would be wasting my time. I really don't think there's going to be any views today. Just watching puddles gathering. At this point, I'm convinced Pennsylvania just is bound and determined to test me all the way to the end. Bring it on, Pennsylvania. Even the side paths around the flooded areas are flooded. <laughs> 